guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing the $20 challenge makeup tag. I think that's the correct name for the tag, I'm not really sure, but I'll write it down in the title above anyways. Okay, so for the tag, I try not to use a lot of e.l.f. products because e.l.f. products are usually really cheap and that's really easy. So I did make it a little bit more challenging and it's not as easy as you think. Okay guys, so let's get started with the tutorial. I'm going to be showing you what products I'm using and how much they cost as I go along through the video. Okay, so I'm going to start with the foundation and the one I'm using is the Rimmel Match Perfection. And I got the shade 120 Ivory. I picked up this one at Target and it was $4.99. So right now we're at $4.99 before tax. I'm just going to shake it up real quick and... I'm going to use my fingers. I wasn't sure if I could use my own brushes, but I'm not. I'm going to use my fingers just because I don't know if that's part of the rules to not use your own brushes. So I'm going to be on the safe side and use my fingers. And I didn't have enough money to purchase a concealer because I went over like a few cents over $20 so I'm gonna use the foundation as my concealer as well but I'm just gonna use very very little and pat it underneath my eyes I wouldn't recommend you to use your foundation as concealer because foundations are usually really heavy and you don't want to get fine lines real quick but for this tutorial I'm just gonna make an exception and use my foundation as my concealer as well and I also didn't have enough money to buy an eyeshadow primer, so I'm going to be using the foundation as my eyeshadow primer as well. So just use your foundation as an eyeshadow primer. I already let my foundation set for about two minutes because I didn't have enough money to purchase a setting powder. So I just kind of let it set on my face on its own. Okay, so the next product I actually purchased about a year or two ago. It's a nail product. It's the you can't really see the name because it's already rubbed off. It's the Bronzer and Blush Duo. This one retails for about $3 pretty much in all places. So right now we're about $7.99 before tax. Oh my gosh, guys. I feel so dumb right now because I didn't think about how I was going to apply the Bronzer and Blush. Apparently, I can't use my fingers. And I didn't purchase a brush. So I feel like I don't know if I should skip this step or... Okay, so I think I am going to make an exception for this. I'm pretty sure everyone has a brush, hopefully, so you can use whichever brush you want, okay? So, let's go ahead and just apply the bronzer. I'm going to take a little bit more of the bronzer and apply it to the top of my forehead, really close to the hairline now I'm gonna take the blush with the same brush that I'm not supposed to be using but I'm just gonna put it on my cheeks take some more okay so now we're gonna start with the eyes and I'm gonna start off by doing my brows for the brows I'm gonna use this wet n wild pencil and I've heard a lot of people rave about this pencil and it was really cheap I think it was like 97 cents so if I add up everything so far, it's only $8.96, so we're still doing good. Okay. So I already opened it, and it's time to line the brows. I hope it's not too dark. Let's start lining the brows. Ooh. Okay, so my eyebrows look super, super dark. Um, not sure if I like that or not. Okay, so for the rest of the eyes, I got this Wet n Wild Fergalicious or Fergavicious eye kit. I got this kit at HEB, and I believe not everyone has HEB. I don't know if it's just in Texas. And HEB is basically a grocery store where there's also a makeup aisle so I picked this one up there and this one was only $7.99 so if we add everything up let's see 
We still have a few more bucks to spend because we're at $16.95. And let me show you this kit because it's pretty awesome. So this kit has everything you need to achieve a perfect smoky eye. It has the eyeshadow quad which has really pretty colors. It has a black liquid liner. It has a pencil which is silver. I don't think I'm going to be using this one. But it also comes with a mascara, a nasty little brush okay so I'm gonna be taking this first color right here and I'm gonna use that as my base so I'm just gonna put it all over my eyelid next I'm gonna take the black this black looks really pigmented but let's see how it goes on and I'm gonna apply it on my eyelid and I'm gonna blend it upwards okay so after that I'm gonna take the gray color right here I'm gonna place it on the crease now I'm gonna take this really pretty burgundy color and I'm gonna place that on the outer part of the eye this should make it look a little bit more warm. Okay, now I'm going to take the liquid liner that comes in the kit and I'm going to line my eyes. And I'm going to do a cat eye, so I am going to flick out a wing. Now I'm going to take the silver liner that comes in the kit and I'm going to apply it the very inner corner it has a little bit of glitter so it's gonna look really pretty in there okay and the last thing is mascara so I'm gonna take the mascara that comes in the kit whoa it looks really really weird where are the teeth? You can't even see the teeth. Can you see the teeth? Can you see that? There's no teeth and sorry, but it kind of looks like a tampon too. Looks really, really weird. Okay, but I guess let's give it a shot. Okay, so, oh, oh, I forgot to do this step. Okay, so since I couldn't afford or I couldn't, I didn't have enough money to buy an eyelash curler, I'm actually going to take a spoon and this is an old trick that my mom taught me. You're just going to use this side of the spoon and put it against your lashes. Use your thumb and just pull it. Don't pull too hard because you don't, oh, okay, because you don't want to pull your lashes or jank your lashes out. I'm pretty sure everyone has a spoon at home, so just get one from your kitchen and start doing this. Okay, so now that I failed at curling my eyelashes, I'm just gonna apply the mascara. Whoa! Where did the teeth come from? Look at this now! Okay, so I showed you guys earlier how it didn't have any teeth. Remember? I don't know where those teeth came from, and I swear it's the same mascara. Isn't that weird? Okay, so now I'm just gonna apply the, this mascara, which is freaking me out because I swear I didn't see any teeth at first, and now it has a bunch of teeth. It's really, really weird. Okay, so the last thing that we need to complete the look is lips. And I'm going to use the e.l.f. Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick. This one's in the color in the nude. I also got this one at Target and it was only $2. So if we add everything together, the total is $18.95. So plus tax, it would probably be like around $19 or $20. But I'm pretty sure it's no more than $20. It won't open. Whoa. Okay. Ooh, I like it. it smells kind of weird. Oh. So the actual makeover or the whole makeup 
$20 makeup challenge isn't that bad. I actually like it. I would wear this out, but I would probably use some of my own brushes instead of this little brush right here. But yeah, I had a lot of fun doing this tag. I tagged all of you. If you liked this video, don't forget to like this video. If you want to stay tuned for more of my videos, just don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Okay, so thank you for watching my video, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye!